Alright, Hunter and Hunter says, welcome back to some more Ruby Arafel, and this is the first Ruby Arafel gameplay of 2024. I kind of forgot now what I was doing uh, the last time that we played this. Uh, we were. I mean, we're going. We're going through mantle. But now I forgot what we were doing in mantle. I guess we'll find out once we get to the end of this. Nothing, I guess. <laughs> All right, where do I need to go? Ah, up there. That's where I need to go. To Atlas. Golly, I hate what she does now. Just jump, stop doing that. Stop doing that. Stop jumping out the way and shoot. My God. Ah. 
Ow. Ow. The Swiss stay I <laughs> Come on. Oh, I hate when she does that every single time. Left or right? I'll go left. There's a safe point. That point take that. Let's head left. Oh, this is where the ambush was. I've got a feeling like I've been here before. Yeah, I have. So I need to head back. Oh my god, I didn't know you were gonna jump.
Right, save. <laughs> this time to the right. And Yang. Okay, enough of that. Do the thing on this. Twice. Oh wait, there was another one. Oh, they've spawned again now. <laughs> right. I'm gonna get out, Yang. Skill point, I assume. Yep. I'm ducking down. Uh, before I go over there, I've got, wow, six skill points that I need to use. So, I'll give melee attack for Ruby. Uh, range attack for Weiss. Um, defense for Blake. Uh, energy heal Yang. Uh, range attack Ruby. Energy heal Weiss. And we are good. Yep, all good. Let's go. Ambush time. It's something to do with a uh, five stone, I think, the, for the part of the mission. I've already faced against him. I uh, defeated him and his, like, Pokeballs. <laughs> so called Pokeballs. This is why I use Yang as my main, because she's got rapid fire punches. This is why. Oh, we got another Pokeball. Gotta destroy them all. I'm just heading straight for it and just gonna kill it off. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Four orbs destroyed. Is it? It is four this time, right? Yeah, it's four. Yes, that makes four. We did it. Go Team Ruby. Hold the celebration. We need to head back to General Ironwood without delay. Excellent work again, team. All four orbs appear to be destroyed and any remaining Grim have vacated the areas. Was there any ever doubt? 
Maybe a little. <laughs> I meant from Ironwood, sis. Regrettably, Lieutenant Harper has just received intel on yet another urgent threat. We're not catching a break, are we? Lieutenant, if you will. T. T. Ruby, a new transmission from one of our intelligence brigades indicates that a true threat responsible for the orbs was not Five Stone. It didn't seem that way after what he said. Who was Five Stone working for then? We do not know their exact identity, but what we do know is that they have set up a secret base in the barren tundra to the east. The quickest way to reach the location is by train. Therefore, we are sending a battalion of Elysian forces by train to investigate, and we would like you to accompany them. Let's have you go to Gihon Station, Team Ruby. From there, take the train Harper set up to the location of interest and find out what's going on. If there's a threat, I'll trust you, you'll deal with it. Consider it done. Gihon Station. There, that's where you can find the train that's ready to disembark. It will take you to your next location. Ah, a nice relaxing train ride. That's riding in style for once. <laughs> Let's hope there's room left in the first class car. <laughs> Another bunch of enemies waiting to attack us. <laughs> Why do you always change things? I didn't, but if I did, then I also then I'd like to also jinx that one of the train cars is full of soft bunnies. Enough. We're counting on you, Team Ruby. Good luck. Okay. <laughs> Ah, uh, dear. <clears throat> Imagine if it's like a cutscene and the bunnies just like infiltrated the train. <laughs> and then, and then amidst all the bunnies, you see, um, Velvet. <laughs> that would be, oh, that would be amazing. <laughs> Just to miss all the bunnies and you see velvet. <laughs> uh, you must be the huntresses here to board the caravan. That's right, we've heard there's danger at the coast, and this was the quickest way there. Danger? Um, I'm just a receptionist for the caravan, but... Uh... <laughs> oh, sorry about all that. Yes, we're the huntresses. Not at all. The fair for you and the Elysian soldiers have all been covered by the academy, so we're good to go. That is, we'll leave as soon as you're ready to board. Are you ready? Uh, let's check. Very well. Please step on board and, um, good luck with that danger stuff. Ooh, I would think we're gonna get enemies. Are we? Seems like a casual train ride to me. Oh, it's about to go into the next part. Okay. Oh my god, okay. Gotta take these down. Wait. Oh wait, it's one of these. Uh
Damn. I was gonna uh, use the inventory, but it was too late. <laughs> Um, what's the big idea? This is too weird. The Elysian soldiers got all aggressive and are attacking us. Uh, Something is not right. Well, who do you think? No time, no time to stop and ponder. There's more up ahead. Oh, God. Uh, left or right? Right. Hold on. I saw you spike again. If she didn't keep getting hit. Holy crap. Another ambush. Right. Took one down. Oh, nice. I got a trophy. A shadow of myself. I think I'm down to one ring now. Ow. Another ambush. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh my god! How many ambushes is that in this part of the stage? Is that four? I'm going to... I should have used Blake for her... for a weapon. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> ambush after ambush. Oh, come on. There we go.
There's gotta be a misunderstanding here. Can't we just like talk this out? More incoming ahead. There's just no end to this attack, is there? No. Oh, cutscene. Question and I know the answer Remember, to that. She wanted to get us out here in the middle of nowhere. She set us up. It's a trap. Uh, close. Uh, guys. Close, but we're talking about a general here. More likely, Ironwood. Those guys? <laughs> nah, they can't have done. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Poor Rubes. Whoa, what's this music? <laughs> Sorry, I I'm getting distracted by the music. <laughs> um, it's those other huntresses. Did you see them? Those mercenaries from Essen. What were they called? Uh now I'm starting to forget. Briar Patch or Briar Bunch? Team Briar. Oh, yeah. Team B R I R. That's not as catchy. <laughs> Are you sure it was them, Weiss? Mm -hmm. Positive. Although I'm not sure what they are doing here. Be careful, we might be in for an ambush. Yeah, <laughs> definitely. We did it come this far. This, this song is absolutely catchy. Let's switch the Yang now. No, I dare you, come close again. Skill point. You were right. <laughs> there is an ambush. Keep me going for a little bit. Oh my god. Oh, 
Yes, that's awesome song. <laughs> we did the compass fun. <laughs> Chess, skill point. Ambush. Ambush after ambush.
God. And I thought Grim Eclipse from the first game was a workout. That's how you do it. God damn it, Team Kruby. <sighs> okay. Yay! Save point. <laughs> Thank God for that. All right. Oh, there they are. <laughs> Hello, ladies. Fancy meeting you here. Bianca Prisma. Oh, we already met. Team Ruby at your service. <laughs> An Ivy Fickery. Right, Team Ruby. And your Team Briar, right? We are Bianca, R Rowan, Ivy, and Ruda. How do you know who gets each R? <laughs> what a ridiculous question. It's alphabetical. It is as well, it's alphabetical. Oh. Uh... oh. Enough, ch enough chattering. Let's tear these brats up, Bianca. Get ready for my pins and needles. Stay your whip, Ivy. Let's not be so hasty. I need our new friends to understand just how thorny their current situation is. What? What are you doing here? Cleaning up the trash. Huh? Tell us who you work for, Team Briar. We work for ourselves, but in this case, we're here to stop you from causing any more trouble for Bram Thornmain. Thornmain is behind this? Or his companion? You mean Lieutenant Colonel Harper? Ruby, you were right. Wait, she and Thornmain are... Oh, I feel nauseous. Alright, this is getting old. Come on, Team Briar, let's roll these princesses. Boss battle. Team Briar. Let's do it. Come on. Ow. What the? I'm fine, I'm fine. As long as I don't get hit!
Dame, so close. I tried. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. We've had this. Let's just get to the battle. I like the idea of using Blake, though. Oh my god, how many hits is it going to take?
Got him. Whew. First try. <laughs> I can't believe those kids just overpowered us. Undisciplined little snots, you got lucky. Get ready for round two. Not now, we've got other priorities. Who knows where else Team Ruby here has hidden orbs they stole from Fort Arrowfell. You're kidding, right? We didn't do anything like that. Don't expect us to believe your lies. You know that four main set the record straight shortly after our encounter, right? We've been ready f for all your little scheming plans all along. We seriously didn't steal anything. Did you think we didn't notice you were literally carrying one of the orbs on you the moment we first encountered you? We were investigating it for ourselves, trying to find the origin. We didn't know it was dangerous. They seem sincere. Well, particularly good fakers. That's enough. Our duty as the Keepers of Arrowfell is more important than anything we can accomplish here right now. Until we meet again, Team Ruby, and I'm sure we'll meet again. Well, that's ominous. See? I got goosebumps. Hmm. Ugh. Big talk big talk from a team so easily beaten. I guess those briars aren't so sharp after all. Ha! <laughs> I don't get it. I can't believe they think we were the ones who planted the orbs. It had to be Formain and Harper coordinating this all along. But why? Come on, it's time to get out of here. Right. Right. We better speak with General Lionwood as soon as possible. Let's head back to Atlas Academy then. <laughs> chapter cleared! That's chapter 4 done. Alrighty. Chapter 5. The End of Arrowfell. T. Ruby, apologies for the unnecessary bout of danger. I'm relieved you were able to overcome whatever trap had been set for you. <laughs> no more trains, right? We can all agree on that. That was a rude surprise. Oh. Atlas does strive to protect our own, but it's rare we must account for such a breach of faith. I'm pleased you are all safe. Oh. <laughs> Just when I considered it's best to let go of my trust issues. Well, it appears you have reached the same conclusion. That caravan was said to be a trap by none other than Olive Harper. Where is she now? My fist was like to have a word with her. The lieutenant has escaped, but detaining her is not our highest priority. What? Why? <laughs> That's because the real threat here isn't Harper, is yes. it? Correct. The Aesops pierced to together that this whole plan was secretly orchestrated by four main. Amancio Glass, who was provided the blueprints of Arrowfell technology from him, produced and distributed the tech for personal profit. The most dangerous of the tech, the orbs, were smuggled by Five Stone, who we believe worked under a serious threat. Only his unique semblance could power the orbs. The lieutenant had been spying on the Atlas military from the inside. Each time our intelligence was close to a lead, she would forsake an alley in the operation to misdirect us from the truth. Meanwhile, Four Main has grown powerful enough to amass armies of Grimm of an experimental military grade defense. What we don't know is if this is an attack on the developmental development of an Admiral Tower or something else entirely. However, a foe with Arafel access should have us on the highest alert. Wait, uh... Arafel? That's the suspended military operation? Mm -hmm. Right. My predecessors were the one who put an end to the project for this, very, for this very reason. The technology was deemed too dangerous and high risk in the wrong hands. The keepers of Arafel were the only ones who should have had legitimate access, but their identity were taken to the grave by my predecessors. 
It's been a mystery and potential hole in our security that keeps the Atlas Council up at night. But I don't believe anyone suspected it could be this dire. Hold on, you said the Keepers of Arafel. Do you know something, sis? It was something Bianca said. General Lionwood, the Keepers of Arafel are Team Briar. Then it's true. The unknown group of mercenaries that the Aesops were looking into truly are involved, I say. Team Ruby, I believe you already understand what to do next. You need to find a way into Fort Arafel to halt Thermon Four Main's plans, wherever that may be. The Aesops suspect the entrance to be at these coordinates. The Arafel facility. The orbs are just the beginning, since Four Main has infiltrated for Arafel, there are countless weapons at his disposal. I'll call the Aesops in to assist where possible, but the first line of securing for Arafel and taking down four main is on you, Team Ruby. <laughs> this is the kind of mission we've trained for our whole lives for. Four main has the power to harm many people. We won't let that happen. Hmm. Even if our toughest task, yes, there's no way we'll back down now. Team Ruby is on it. Gen Team Ruby is on it, Gen General Ironwood. Let's go. Alrighty. In the next part, we are going to put a stop to Fawn Main, and hopefully, we will stop uh, Harper as well. Because Harper's betrayed us. Well, she's not the only one who's going to be betrayers in the foreseeable future. I think we all know who. But anyways, I'll see you all in the next one.